funny how time uh, <clears throat> feels sometimes. Like this summer I was uh, devoid of my uh, vehicle. Extracted from my uh, grasp, so to speak. <laughs> Detained, isolated in my apartment in the heat of summer and uh, feeling, well, uh, what now? And the time seemed to last forever. It was hot. I didn't have a means of transportation. And uh, time seemed to last forever. <laughs> <clears throat> of course, some, a few months have passed and time has uh, started to speed up. It seems. I'm no, I know it hasn't, but uh, it seems to have that effect. Anyway, it seems to be flying by now, and uh, the realization of age proceeding along rapidly also. <laughs> age and uh, the feeling of age in the bones and knees and joints. And in the mirror. <laughs> so uh, I take these opportunities to record them. There's a there was an interesting uh, uh, take on it by a scientist that in the future. Uh, Things like this, uh, you will be able to converse with people that have long since passed through digital uh, uh, digital existence. I guess what's left of a person in the digital sense to be recreated as a real entity that you can converse with. So that's part of uh, why I'm doing this. And uh, if you haven't heard about it, it might sound crazy, but if you think about it, uh, if you see any old movie, if you've seen what they've done with holograms lately, Elvis on stage singing and it looks real, so, who knows? Anyway, <laughs> eee. Yeah, the getting getting old seems is real. That's for sure. But don't take my word for it. <laughs> <laughs> 